Hey everyone, welcome to today's episode. If you're familiar with the backdrop of this video, that may be because yesterday, last night, you watched the video tour of that property there, which is a four bedroom detached house priced at 1.2 million. I'm gonna be showing you around this property here today, which is also a four bed detached, priced at 1.2 million, but has some unique differences, and it's gonna be really interesting for us all to compare which we prefer. Now, this one here is actually also for sale. So you've got a gated entrance, and this one has a wraparound garden as well. So that's gonna be slightly more and not finished yet. Obviously this one isn't completely finished yet. There is gonna be a door, don't worry. Um, if you're new to this video though, so we're on Sea Lane in Ferring, which is part of Worthing down on the south coast of England, around 12 miles away from Brighton, if you're not familiar with the location. In yesterday's video, we took a very short trip to the beach. It was really close. At the end of the video, we'll perhaps share how far away that one is as well. Okay, let's start the tour on this property then. So in total, there are five detached homes in this new development and they all have a unique twist, which is nice because whichever one you buy is very individual. These properties are built by designer homes. So if you want any more information, we'll put their contact details in the description and their Instagram, so go check them out. That's right. So here is the off-road parking, comfortably spaced for around four cars, and then you've got some more storage space here. Now, if I was living in this property down at the South Coast, I'd have to keep my jet ski or speedboat there. That yeah. would be perfect. <laughs> and then here is the integral garage, which we're gonna show you a little later. You've got an electric up and over sliding door, access direct to the back and then also into the utility. Well, we're showing them now. We are <laughs> showing you now, yes, but more later. Yeah. Okay, so come up the landscaped front lawn, up a couple of steps, lovely porch area with two down lights and you can see the uh, gray bricks and the white render on the outside, giving it that contemporary finish. Come on in then. So here on this tour, then let's carry on. So this is the cloak room. Now in here, you've got Vilroy and Bosch sanitary wear again, and the porcelain Osa tiles. Obviously the flooring is gonna be finished. That's gonna be carpeted. You can see what the carpet looks like when, you show you, when we show you the stairs. Here's a storage cupboard. This is bigger than the storage cupboard in the other house. Yeah. And the other one was under stair. Shall we put the blue shoes yeah. on? Okay, moving along the hallway then, we've got access through here into the main living room. Come over the hurdle. So slightly different to the other house where you would have seen that the living room was actually connected through open doorway. This one has the same or very similar center feature fireplace and then these large windows onto the front. The other one had a private study yeah. in there, whereas this has a separate living room. That's right, yeah. Keep exploring. I'm still trying to figure out which one I prefer. I'm really Me not too. Sure. I, I like the other one's position a little more, but then this one, I really like the kitchen. Here's the utility and the access to the garage. Space here for your washer and dryer. Now here then is actually the study for this one or another lounge area. So ah. it is kind of different in that respect. And in that way, this feels a little bigger. So this could be a dining room if you didn't want it as a study because it flows quite nicely. But to be fair, like look at all this space. Yeah. You've got space for a massive dining table in here. Great windows throughout, obviously some finishing touches still to be done, like the flooring. You've got the center island with the sile stone worktop. I prefer this kitchen because I like the, I like the center island. Yeah, I totally get that. I like this um, large extractor. You've got the Wi-Fi Neff appliances there as well. Let's have a look then. So what are the drawers like? So we've got very similar drawers to our apartment, the sliding ones. Dishwasher. Okay. Yep, Neff dishwasher. It's so bright in here. That is one thing you really get. Nice sunny day, lots of space. Here's where the fridge or freezer or fridge freezer would go. Oven on this side. Yep, Neff oven. I want to show you this. This is cool. I took a look at this earlier. So basically these cupboards oh. have a load of storage because these pull all the way out like that. Oh yeah. So you've got those there and then above is the same. Ah. There we go. These are Paula Rosa Manhattan kitchen units. So over here then are the doors. Now you can either open them all the way up on a nice sunny day or just use the single access door here. We're backed on to the fairing cricket, cricket ground. Yes. ground, yeah. So great views, and I think slightly better views than the house next door. Very, very similar, 
but just one less tree there so you can actually yeah. see a little bit further onto the cricket ground. Let us know down below which ones you guys are preferring. Now we've still got all of the upstairs to see. Let's go check that out. On the first floor, you can get a better look at what the carpet would look like because it has been fitted here. Lovely grey carpet. We've got four bedrooms. I'm going to show you the principal bedroom first. So this bedroom is at the rear of the property. Now, what do you think? Do you prefer this bedroom or the main bedroom from the property next door? Very similar. Both got the Juliet balconies and a very similar view. Wow, this view is beautiful. Yeah, I think, I think I'm swaying towards this one. Yeah. I prefer the bedroom on this one and the Kitchen. downstairs, you know, living yeah. space. But then I prefer the outside look, you know, of the other property. Same, and it's slightly further back, which means um, you get a bit more front lawn. They've both got the benefits for sure. So this one's got the ensuite again, the Vilwari and Bosch sanitary wear, porcelainosa tiles, privacy window looking outside. Okay, let's keep exploring. Back into the hallway. Here's the family bathroom. Again, porcelainosa tiles with the Vilroy and Bosch sanitary wear bath. And so what do you prefer? Do you prefer the bathroom on this one or the other house? And there's the sink in this window area here. So on the other one, the shower was slightly bigger, I remember that, but then this room as a whole feels larger. Yeah, it does feel bigger. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, what else have we got? Okay, so we've got the three more bedrooms to see. And these feel a bit bigger as well. So this one has a very interesting window which overlooks the front. Again, great views up to the rolling hills. I like that window. And there's also another window here. Here's a look back. Okay, let's check out the last room then. This one overlooks Faring Cricket Club as well and has two decent sized windows. Let's go check out the garden. Nice, so it's a lovely sunny day down here on the south coast. Um, this is a look at the garden. So we've got the patio areas, great for dining straight from the center. Um, and then a nice path from the side access too. And then some lovely lawn area. Let's have a look at the back of the house. At the back. <laughs> what a difference it makes on a sunny day with a blue sky on these house tours. Yeah, it makes, the sun is just amazing. Yeah. I wish England was sunnier. <laughs> it's lovely architecture on these houses. Um, I really do think for, for new builds in the UK, they've done a great job. So on the yesterday's tour as well, we also took a trip down to the beach to see how far it was away. Um, so we'll put some clips on here of what that was like. So we hope you enjoyed this tour. Make sure to like the video if you did. Go check out the other one if you haven't already. Subscribe for more and we'll see you in our next episode.